Carrion, and we could not be more excited to be debuting his Countdown to Christmas 3 or 12 bottle sets. And these are incredible. Don't miss out on this opportunity because what we're going to provide you with tonight or this afternoon will be three or 12 bottles. You may do three of the Cabernet Sauvignon, which is right here. I believe this is the Cab Sav, isn't it? Yes. And then from there, this one is the Syrah, three bottles of the Syrah, three bottles of the Chardonnay, or three bottles of the Sparkling. Chardonnay is the most limited in the three bottle set. Now you can do a, a 12 bottle case of all red. That'll give you six of the Syrah and six of the Cab Sav. On the far end, I can do all white, six Chardonnay, six Sparkling. Or we can do our mixed, and the mixed is going to be three of each varietal. And that's always most popular. Let's also show you our delivery map real very quickly. And it's important to know that we deliver to any state shaded in gold. Any of the gray shaded states, we sadly do not deliver to, so we would encourage you to make friends with someone in a gold shaded state. In the meantime, let's welcome in Iron Chef Jeffrey Zakarian to talk about these wines. We'll do some sampling, we'll do a little talking, no big whoop. Come on in, sir, it's nice to have you here. <laughs> David, I, I don't know about you, but uh, that coffee and those cookies, really milk, yes, but sparkling wine, very cold, about 42 degrees, uh-huh. I mean, are you kidding me? I want to just drink that and have some fun with it. Aha. So, Chef, talk to us about first, how do you uh, come upon these wines? What, what role do you okay. take in them? Uh, tell us about them. Yeah. Okay, everything is restaurant quality. Everything is, I'm doing all the work for you. You know, when you walk into a wine store, I actually have the same problem. It's overwhelming. It's like, I mean, it's like walking into like a Walmart, but it's all wine. You just like, okay. I have a pretty good knowledge of wine. So what do I want to do? So I've tested and taken all the work out of this and I've approved wines. I blind test these, meaning I wrap them in bags, test them once, text them the actual next day, and then I choose them the third day to make sure that you can actually sit them in the, in the fridge if you want for another day. And then I unwrap them, it's like an unveiling. So I try to get basic. What do you want? What does the customer really want to taste? Quality wine, every one of these are a uh, metal winning wine. They have all the characteristics of what you want in the particular wine. So the Chardonnay is a perfect Chardonnay. The Cab is a perfect Cab and the Syrah is a perfect Syrah. And same thing with the uh, sparkling wine. That's what I do. Take all the work out of it for you guys at home. So chef, let's begin with the Cab, uh, the Cabernet Sauvignon. And I'm going to pour myself right. some here and would love for you <laughs> to describe this one. You just keep pouring, David. I think it's been that kind of week, right? <laughs> All right, you want to have a burger. This is my burger wine. I'm just going to go there right now. Let's just go there. I'm throwing it out. I'm having a burger. This is what I'm having. A cab or a cab or a big, dark, delicious wine like this mm. that has lots of cherry, lots of cassis, so well balanced. Again, award winning. And I'm telling you, if you don't want beef, a nice blackened salmon or some cheddar is perfect. And I mean, it's just, you swoon when you smell that, right? And it almost smells like the chocolate and the coffee you were selling. It just has that remarkable sort of de deepness. And I just love the balance of this. Very food friendly. I recommend this really a million times over if you want to oh. impress your guests. And chef, just last night or just yesterday afternoon, I went to my butcher and bought a beautiful ribeye and came home and grilled it for my dinner. That would have been a lovely pairing with that ribeye. Sign wow. the painting. Oh, now let's talk about your Syrah. Yes, Syrah is, um, um, it's like one of these easy drinking California wines, a little smoky, a little peppery, but if you want to have like a, 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 a grilled steak, grilled lamb, even I think, even if you're going with like grilled corn, a little chili, some pecorino cheese, I, David, nothing more than, I know you and I are big cheese, cheese fans. Yes. Chunks of pecorino cheese in a pile. Forget it. I just, that's my dinner. And this wine is perfect. It's a beautiful 2020 Myth Syrah. Um, just a gorgeous, again, award winning, just a very, very reputable wine. And I, I love unveiling these when I taste them blind because I'm like, it's just a surprise to me. And it's just amazing how good and well made this is. A really balanced wine, very, very good to serve with like a great cheese plate. And a nice smooth finish, Chef, which I think is so beautiful. important with a red. Now, let's talk about mm. your Chardonnay. 
Chardonnay, everybody's favorite. If I had to go to one wine, it would be a Chardonnay. Very cold, 45 degrees. Any kind, any kind of pasta, any kind of seafood, lobster roll, charcuterie board, a shrimp, a poached shrimp, a grilled shrimp, even a scampi. Mm. Silver medal winning, uh, incredibly, 2019 Ashara. Um, sunny, rich, creamy, floral, uh, just... Just the smell is just enough to remind you of all the things you like about wine. Mm. And when I have this in the fridge all the time, it's what, like, when I have guests over, I'm like, what would you like? Do you have any Chardonnay? Chardonnay? And it's always cold. And that's something I want to impress upon everybody, to always have really good cold Chardonnay ready to go. Would you pair that Chardonnay with, say, Thanksgiving turkey? Absolutely. I would never say no to Thanksgiving turkey. <laughs> Even I would love the Syrah with turkey as well all right and then if you want that chardonnay i have 350 in the three bottle now let's talk sparkling and i believe mary has a little sparkling over there too she doesn't like to miss out on the sparkling right, no come. one wants to miss out on sparkling especially me but i think you and i are pouring it the correct way i always tell people in the side of the glass like a draft beer so you the suds end up as bubbles the bubbles don't end up as suds and you oh there's mary hi cheers mary. to you hi gz how are you cheers um you know what, great wh like one of our crew members is getting married on september 26th so i'm toasting to them mm. wow mm -hmm. that is just incredible and talk about that yes incredible mm -hmm. for a mm -hmm. holiday a family event like a marriage and this is like oh it's this good. selection it's is really great good. for holidays this whole selection for thanksgiving you know order it in get it ready no one's gonna this is like the entire meal appetizer to dessert and let me tell you that coffee of those cookies with this george phillips again another fantastic bubbly apple pear citrus very cold i recommend this at about 42 degrees uh-huh so you really taste the real refreshingness of sparkling wine from california it's Not, very nice and very too. unique and you know what's yeah. really remarkable here, and Chef said this early on, mm -hmm. we walk into a wine store and we're completely overwhelmed because there's so many choices. And we know a little bit of why about a wine, or maybe we know nothing at all, maybe we know a lot. We're still overwhelmed by the sheer number of choices. For sure. I feel much better having an Iron Chef choose the wine for me. And he didn't just pick out some of his, his personal favorites, he blind taste tested these. That's right. So he'd be able to bring you something that was really, really extraordinary and then give you great ideas for pairing. And one thing, GZ, I think we've learned is that there are no hard, fast rules with pairing. It's what you enjoy. Is that right? Absolutely. It's just like painting or, or an art artist. If you like the artist, like there's an artist hanging up on my wall, I like it. It's not particularly expensive. I just like it. And that's the same way with your wines. The value in these wines is really remarkable. And it's when I do for my restaurant, I pick wines out of wines I know. So they give me the list and I see what it is already. And I make presuppositions as to what's going to be good. I, I, I prejudge, which is bad. I just drink these, they're in a bag, I have no idea, and guess what, all the work is done for you. You don't have to worry about lugging around, you know, all kinds of like big cases. This comes right to your door, and you don't have to go to a liquor store again. It's really, really a very lovely way of existing when you have someone like myself choosing wines for you. Now, we're going to ship all these immediately, and obviously, you're going to be able to keep these all the way through the holiday season. I have a three-bottle set of just the Cab Sav. 400 remaining there, three bottle of the Syrah, 380, three bottle of the Char uh, Chardonnay, 300, and three of the Sparkling, 600. Now, you can also do a case of all red that give you three, excuse me, six of the Cab Sav and six of the Syrah, 400 left here. In the all white, which gives you six of the Chardonnay and six of the Sparkling, 400 there. But what is most popular today is the mixed and only 1800 to go around. Now remember, we also have an auto delivery opportunity here as well, and I believe that's going to ship every four months for a year. Let's take a look at our delivery map again. And GZ, it's important for everyone to realize that if your state is shaded in gold, we can ship your wine to them. Is that correct? That's correct, and believe me, that, that, those gray states are shrinking as more and more states open up. Um, very to say, the map about three years ago was a little uh, more but now almost every state so we're very excited about that well we're thrilled to have these wines and we're going to encourage all of you to think about gift giving and also entertaining this holiday season and who better than an iron chef to choose your wine for you iron chef jeffrey zakarian good to have you back my friend thank you david i'm gonna see you later i hope oh that's true you will very good
All right, stay on the line here. We'll get you all straight away. And let's also remind you about the Carnivore Club.